Welcome back to another On the Trail video, with this video featuring a trail that is a lot closer to home for me. The trail being featured in this video is the Wishart Trail at the Wood Nature Center, which is in Red Deer, Alberta. The Wishart Trail is a 4.3 km loop trail that is ideal for gauging if the younger members of your family can do these lengthy hikes with some but minimal elevation gain. As if the younger members of your family can do this hike with ease, then they most likely can do some of the lengthier hikes in the Rockies, such as Bosom, which is a 5.8 km round trip, and Lake Agnes, which is a 6.8 km round trip. The trail starts off at the back end of the Kerrywood Nature Center and branches off from the Dr. George Trail within the first 10 meters, with the hike be being a simple stroll through the area that was once the Glen Ear Farm. From the grassland that the cow grazed on to the trees, which were common on the early homesteads in the Red Deer area, after hiking for a few minutes, you can look at the West Gates Lake from the self-viewing platform from which you can see the waterfowl that make the Gates Lake Sanctuary their home during the summer, such as buffalo heads and other waterfowl, along with the beaver lodge that is continually used by the, lo by the local beaver clan. Looking across, you can see where the, where the two lakes were divided by a landslide a long time ago. Now we cross the bridge and walk along a boardwalk, which provides spectacular views of the West Lake, where sometimes one can view muskrats, beavers, and frogs, depending on the time of the year. Um, I really enjoy coming to the Gates Lake Sanctuary, as I love uh, taking videos, obviously, and doing photography and writing. I love writing. I sometimes write poetry based on the nature that I've seen like at the Gates Lake Sanctuary. Uh, sometimes I write short stories from the point of view of, say, a beaver and how it was uh, affected by humans coming in to its natural habitat. I try to vary my writing so it isn't the same old, same old for me. And I just love how I can just come, it, just bike down from my house and come to this natural area and be away from the city life for maybe an hour or two hours. Now, hiking through the dense spruce forest, keep an eye and ear out for one of the area's prominent re residents, the red squirrel, who can be quite the nuisance at times, as me and my family know, and the forest is much cooler, as it blocks much of the summer heat due to the canopy being a lot denser than its birch tree counterpart at the top of the hike. Uh, crossing over a boardwalk, the real test of endurance and strength begins as you hike up a steep hill, which is then followed by a set of stairs, which then leads to the top of the sanctuary, your Michener Hill. From a viewpoint at the top of the sanctuary, you can see the East Gates Lake and the downtown core of Red Deer. Thanks for watching, smash that like button if you liked the video, and if you've not done so already, please subscribe to the channel as it means the world to me. Be on the lookout on for the third video in the On the Trail video series, which is going to be close to home based in the Red Deer area, or if you guys have suggestions for me, I would be open to having a look into them and doing some of them, if at all possible for me. So yeah, thanks for watching.